What's up guys, we're here, welcome back, good morning. I hope everybody's having a great day. Today we are gonna be taking a look at the Diablo 4 shop. It had just dropped maybe a little bit ago and I just missed it, but I just woke up. Um, so I had to get this video out to you guys, but today we are gonna be looking at the Diablo 4 shop, all of its details, how it works, and just kind of check it out and see if it's actually worth it. Let's get right into it. Okay guys, so we're over here at the main menu, we're at the shop. We're gonna hop off, we're gonna go check this thing out right now. Let's cut the music. All right. Ooh, okay. All right. Okay guys, let's take a look. So you got the shop in here. This is something they had told us about uh, coming in to the game that we were gonna have a cosmetic shop on top of the battle pass. Now, let's just go ahead and navigate through this thing. You have your cosmetics, your add-ons, and then your platinum. <clears throat> Every two days and 11 hours, the shop will refresh, so there'll be newest cosmetics for you guys to get. Um, so, you have the recommended for you. I guess this is based on the more cosmetics that you get. It's just going to recommend uh, ones that you could get, or maybe the better ones for the classes that you're playing. Uh, then you got class-specific, so Barbarian, Druid, Necro, Rogue, Sorcerer. Then you have the Mount exclusives which are really really cool now all of these cosmetics are on top of all the cosmetics that you have in the main game okay let's go to our add-ons tab so our add-ons tab this is where you can purchase them flat out just $6.99 and you're able to get the crypt hunter horse cosmetic and then you can go through here and it'll show you everything that it includes so you get the ice That's howl bold choice. right you get to check the thing out it's kind of lit right not bad we go back we got the crypt hunter beginnings end that's kind of nice and then your you, yes. little shovel as well as how much it costs uh platinum which is their in-game currency okay so not bad there right for add-ons this is really cool this is going to expand as it goes on and these are probably probably limited edition so that we're going to have x you know, X to Y time to get these and then they'll go away. Then you got platinum. Okay, so this is the in-game currency and you can see you can buy platinum. This is their amounts, right? A dollar gives you 200, $5 for 500, $10 for a thousand and so on. But when you look at these, like this is 699. So, well, I can't spend $5, I have to spend $10. So it's gonna take, you know, or it's $6, but Let's look at the cosmetics. So, for example, let's go in. Let's check some stuff out. So, you have some that are 2,800, some that are 2,400. Accessories ah, that you good. can just add on, which are separate, right? So, you get all three of these, and that's 1,000. So, this accessory is $10, 2,400. So, you'd have to spend... You'd have to spend $25 no matter which way you slice it. So you'd have to spend $25 for those. You'd have to spend $20 for these because you can't get to, I guess you could get to $1,500 because you could go $10, $15, $16, $17. dollars So you're almost at $20 for a $1,600. So I guess it comes down to what exactly you're interested in for the cosmetic shop. Uh, and just see the I mean it's it's really cool and you can actually see exactly how your character will look I mean the drip is awesome right like the drip looks really cool um, weapon cosmetics can only be applied to weapon or equipped weapons of the same type so like this one is a mace so it has to be a mace right but you can go through here and you can just kind of see everything that's added on here which is cool I mean I think the drip is is awesome but I don't know, 2,200 coins. I mean, you're talking about me spending at least 20, $22 just for one cosmetic set. I mean, I know you're getting all the sets, but uh, you know, that that's a lot just for cosmetics guys when there's a lot of cosmetics in the game. So I don't know if it's entirely worth it um, I do think some things are cool, like maybe the 800 ones might be worth it for the back drip um, or the armor, like that one's 1700. Maybe those that are like cheap like that, but I mean, like this one, if I wanted this one for my druid, I That's mean, 2600. I mean, 
I look like a gesture. And for 2800 like, I got to spend $25 just for one skin? Uh, I don't know if it's entirely worth it. But, guys, the shop is here. It's really cool. Maybe the mount ones are actually would be cool to have because the mounts are actually really cool looking in the game. Uh, maybe these because these are cheap. They're a thousand a piece. Like having a mount, like maybe I would be more apt to get these ones instead of the actual uh, class ones. But um, yeah, there goes the shop, guys. It's how you use it, how everything's on here, all the add ons, the cosmetics, and then the in game currency. It's just really cool. It dropped today. So I wanted to bring you guys a quick video and show you guys how it worked. So like the video if you guys have enjoyed it. Comment down below what do you guys think about the shop and the prices and let me know if you think it's worth it to get any of these cosmetics. And then make sure to subscribe if you guys are new. And as always, stay gaming. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.